Meanwhile, in the lane, they go to Miller. Her shot misses it from the right side, but the rebound by Moore. She misses the putback. Right side, Miller the rebound. Puts it up. It is in. Foul. Count the basket. It's a three-point play, and the Eagles lead by four. And they go on top now here to Ashlyn Sharp. Left side to Lone. Baseline to Laney Sharp. Baseline 12-footer. Nails it. Swishes it through. And Central leads. This is an 8-0 run by the Warriors. Loose ball picked up by the Warriors. Right side. Ash for three. Got it from the right wing. Well, Ash hitting a couple of threes, and the Warriors getting all sorts of results here. 21-0 run and a timeout by the Eagles. 25-10. Central in the lead. Keel in the backcourt goes back to Ash, and the game comes to an end. Central, a slow start, trailed by six early, but a dominant second quarter when they held the Eagles scoreless, outscored them by 17 points in the second quarter. 17-0. They win by 17. Central 49, Clayton Ridge 32. That's the final score. Caleb Helly, baseline to Mosier. Right side gets a step by Barrett's Pump fakes, leaves the shot short, gets his own rebound, put back from the right side up and in, got it to roll through. And here's a timeout by Central just like that. Great start for the Eagles on the road. Three minutes in, they lead 11-2. Bielbauer, left side to Helly. Deep three by the UIC logo, got it. Foot on the U, hits the three. And the Eagles lead by 25. Caden Erickson trying to go inbounds, and it's intercepted by Mosier, who stumbles to the court and saves it back to Caleb Helly. Helly drives in, double pump layup up and in from the left side. And the Eagles lead by 27. That's just hustle all the way around. Clayton Ridge wins their fifth in a row. The Eagles again, another lockdown night defensively. They win big over Central. 59-20 the final score. The best high school basketball is on KCTN FM 100.1.